We went viral. Got to be fucking kidding me. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, man. All right. I guess, do I have to address the horseshoe memes? Yeah, well, the American political division is fake. So by pointing out there's a horseshoe, you're only pointing out that you've never been a leftist. You've always been an establishment cuck. That's all you're pointing out by pointing out a horseshoe. Like, yeah, you've just been a fucking establishment cuck this whole time. Here's my question. We are communists with a capital C, right? Right? Communism with a capital C? Okay. Well, we don't have anything to lose. I don't know what you're trying to defend, liberals. Oh, turkeys and, and, and far-right people are, are superficially appear to be on the same page that the establishment's going to be brought down. Okay. And? Like... You think I care about protecting your salaried PMC position? Do you think I give a fuck about your sense of fucking uh, ideological comfort and institutional comfort? You think I give a shit about you, bitch? You leftists? You think I give a fuck about you who have so much to lose? I don't give a fuck about you. You think I'm here to make you feel safe? Like, what does pointing this out accomplish? What does it point? What does it accomplish exactly? Tell me what what you're pointing out. Tell me what you're pointing out. What does it accomplish? That from your perspective, tankies are no better than Nazis. But all that tells me is that being a Nazi is your first option when you stop being a liberal. All that tells me is that you don't care about the contradictions of liberalism and that the minute they're forced upon you, being a Nazi is going to be your first choice. All it's telling me is that between the Soviet Union and the Nazis, you don't think there was any decisive battle. Well, may as well let the Nazis win. That's your fucking mentality. You're not proving, you're not discovering some secret alliance between us. What you're doing is proving that you're oblivious to liberalism's contradictions and that fascism is your first option. And, you know, I don't care if you're a soy boy, whatever. I'm not here to make you feel valid. I'm actually make, here to make you feel like shit because you're cringe.